Here we are with light heavyweight contender Yusef Mack, who on June 25th makes the first attempt at the world title when he takes on Tavares Cloud in St. Louis on uh, on HBO. How you doing? A few weeks out. <laughs> I'm good. I'm ready to rumble, man. T Tavares Cloud. Tavares Cloud. What's he bring to the table? Pressure. How have you been? Um, <clears throat> Simulating that and sparring. A lot of movement, a lot of movement, a lot of shadow boxing. You know, get my legs strong. A lot of squats. You, you, you've had a few. You've had a few setbacks. Um, and uh, you, and now you got to this point after like those losses to Andrade and Barrio and Glenn Johnson. Did you think this title opportunity would ever come? You no. Know, this has always been my dream. So I'm here now, and I got to take advantage of it. Cloud's a guy. They're they're already. I, I know you you read the internet. They're already talking about his next fight. You know, they're talking about maybe him fighting Pascal or something. Right. I mean, is that, is that extra, a little extra yeah, motivation? I want him to look past me. The way the more he looks past me, the more he's doing out of the fight already. He's taking himself out of the fight. We're here for a day with Bernard okay. Hopkins. He, you know, you see he's got all these world title belts uh, next to him and everything like that. Is that, is that even more motivation? Because he's going to pass the torch to me. I'm the next thing, you know. Once he's gone, I'll be right here, holding the city down. You fought on HBO pay-per-view once. This is now your regular HBO yeah. debut. Um, again, uh, thrown into the spotlight. Uh, how do you feel fighting on HBO? Regular. I'm just taking like I'm fighting at the Blue Rod. No nervousness, you know. I'm, I'm at my home, you know. Have you do fought? I do. Have you fought a guy like Tavares Clow? Yes. Who's that? Glenn Johnson. And. Uh, you, you feel that uh, you know they they fought a, a close fight. I you, thought it was a draw. What 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 what's the key to victory? Moving boxing. There are times where, where sometimes he he he's a lot brings a lot of energy and you know you may be forced at moments to slug. Are you ready? Are you ready yes, for that? I'm ready for whatever. Like if it comes to that, let's do it. But my whole thing is the boxing, boxing, boxing. Later around boxing, you know. Anything you want to say in closing as Steve Cunningham uh, passes us by here? I'm about to join him. Well, hold on. So we got we got maybe maybe number one over here. Here's number two, and maybe number, number three. three on June 20th. We'd be the only city with three world champions. Yeah, that'd be hot. You know what I mean? We got, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. My man gonna do what he got to do. Why are you crashing his interview? Oh, you know, this is my man right here. This family right here. You, see, you guys are in the same gym. Same gym, yeah. yeah. I know he brings that belt every day because because <laughs> he got, oh, hey, he got a picture. He got a picture right over top of the speed bag. It expires me every day when I look at the belt. He probably has a picture on top of his bed. Day hey, I bring the, the belt show. only because Nas make me man. He make me bring it all the time. Well, when you see him bring that belt, but it's good though. It's good for the kids. It's good for you know. The kids when you see him bring that belt, it's the IBF belt, the same exact belt. Yeah, I, yeah. Sl I slept with that belt in Germany. He did actually. I'm um, out on that note. <laughs> See, what, what, when are you fighting next? August 26th, Germany. Is that official? Yep. Breaking news, we have an opponent? Breaking news. Uh, anything you want to say in closing after all that, after that guy came in? And the news. We will see you June 25th in St. Louis. You know it.